those footsteps are undoubtedly covered in blood, so... Alright. Let's find my way around, I guess. What's this? Oh, there's a phone! Okay. Alright, let's see if we can uh, get some help here. Hello. Hello. I need an ambulance. Can you hear me? I need help. Um. What had happened? This cold. The darkness around me. I was usually not afraid of the dark. But there. On that day. I remembered I had a matchbox somewhere in my jacket. The urge to light a match was growing with every new chill running down my spine. Alright, got a box of matches. Ah, oh, 6 out of 12, okay. Get some light. Well... Uh, okay, so... Oh, I saw that. Okay, there's someone or something else in here with me. So, where's the front door? Right, okay, can I not just go outside? Um... Hello? Because there's a lamp out there. I could just use the lamp. God, this probably doesn't last very long. What's this? The edge was hardly reliable. Well, I could set it on fire, sort out this match problem. Okay, I'm not going to go through any doors just yet. I'm going to see if I can find anything in the immediate area. Ah, okay, right. Can I? Can I turn this off? Or no, I don't think I can. Um, there's no button f to just turn the turn the match off, so what I'll do is I'll just see what I can get, because having a, that light is nice, but I get the feeling that if the door's going to shut on me, the lights can quite easily just turn off. Okay, so someone definitely has walked in here. Get a new hat. Okay, in the 1930s, quite possibly, yes. Not in today's uh, society. Well, can't get out into Narnia. Now, there's this... Oh, oh god. Without light, I couldn't do anything. Okay. Can I pick up what's probably a box of matches, then? Is that footsteps? Um... Okay, I'm just going to get another match out. Yeah, and it goes away. Okay, that was... All kinds of creepy. Uh, can I not... Pick those up? No? Okay. Uh... What's this? Hello? <laughs> it doesn't look like much of a landscape in black and white, but... Okay, there's a spade right there. Can I not just... Yeah. Can I not just use it as a weapon? No. Alright, let's have a look at the news. It seems someone had been busy in that garden lately. The mud was still fresh. Yes, it was. Oh, so maybe this is actually mud and not blood, but still... Alright, let's turn, this, turn the light on in this place. get some rest and save my progress. Okay, that's, that looks good. First things first, though, is I'm going to use use the match as much as I can. So I'm going to go around the edges before it runs out. And I'm going to rush over and... Uh, oh, I think that's an indication it's running out soon. Okay, so we'll see what we can get. God, this feels like playing Cluedo, doesn't it? In the library. William is seven today. 
He is with Henry, running after the servants in the garden, dressed up like monsters from space. Games, always games. The mansion is always upside down and their yells give me an awful headache. I'm now cloistered in the office, unable even to, even to pray. Henry's fantasies keep William away from his great destiny. I have to bring him back with me, as this will be my only chance to make a man out of him. To make him embrace the Venter Cross. Legacy. To show him the way. Henry is a dreamer, and he has no ambition whatsoever. He can't teach him anything. Behind every great man there is a great woman. Nonsense! Women should always be on the front line. This is where the opposite brought us. I have no illusion about how little power the world is leaving in the hands of women. But Wim William is young. He is the future. I will act through him. And I may finally fall upon this house, may William stop running after the deceiving lights to find the place he deserves in this world. Well, that was weird, and very 1930s. Is the cross he was talking about this? Well, if anything, it shows that they were Christians, so I don't know what to say about that. Okay. Oh, oh. Okay, just in case, I'm gonna light another one. Uh, that's just the book again, so let's have another quick look around. Is this okay? I'm not exactly sure which door I came in again. Old science books. Can I see anything on top? No. Okay. Get off that. Oi. All right. Can I see out the window? Yeah. Okay. There's nothing going on outside, so that's something. It does, however, mean that anything that is going on. Is happening in here. Oh god. Okay, so maybe it is outside? I'm not sure if that's a good thing or not. Suffocating in its useless illuminations and frills, the mansion doesn't have the greatness befitting a fortune like the Vespers. It's the work of a degenerate romantic. It's like a stain in this century. I ordered the flower beds on the east side of the garden to be removed. They made moving around complicated, and in summer their scent was unbearable. I didn't talk about it to Henry, and he was quite upset. For the first time, I think I saw something like rage in his eyes. For a few seconds he did look like a man, and then he shut himself back in his melancholy, and played the piano all afternoon. His jazz again, this stupid music which reeks of debauchery and misery. Okay, that does suggest, however, that there is something in the other room. If I can find a piano, maybe I can actually do something. Okay, let's check the news. The small statue of a lunar goddess that stood in the parlour felt like a comforting presence. I think that may be an indication that I can save in this room. Also, another thing that that thing mentioned was... Oh, hang on, what's this? The time came when we stopped counting. We stopped counting how many companies closed in the past nine years. How many unemployed and families ended up in the streets, forced to live in slums around our cities. We stopped counting all the commodities wasted because nobody could buy them, thrown to the sea or burnt. We stopped counting how many of our business partners fell with us. It was nine years ago, on October 29th, 1929, born from the sick and speculative belly of America. The crash would throw the world into a storm and darkness. We are still here, but we lost faith. We stopped counting, because these were just figures. Because today, they make us feel nauseous. Dawn seemed far at that time, and today, some think they can see the sunrise. They seem to forget night and darkness are always out there, somewhere. Okay, as I think it's kind of paused when I read this. Right, so there could be something in the east part of the garden that I could look at. So I'll remember that if I next get a chance to go outside. That's a camera. Let's have a look at this. Um, what is there? Okay, I'm not sure if I'm supposed to take pictures of anything. Is that in the camera already, or...? I'm not really sure what to do with this. But if I can, I'll hold on to it. Okay. 
Ah, okay, so I did collect that. I imagine because of how this game goes, I'll get a chance to... Oh, God. Uh... Do need some more of these. Hang on. Can I pick them up? Yes. Oh, okay. There is actually a limit to how many I can carry with me. Alright, well, I'll take this opportunity to find that seat where I can go and save it. I think it was... No, it wasn't this one. Uh, was it over here? Was it this one? Yes, it was. Okay. Oh, okay. And I, you actually use up the light for that. Interesting. Are you there? Okay. Well. Ah, nice. Okay. I don't. Oh, hang on. None of that. Right. Okay. So I can run around. Try and uh, make use of this. I don't know if this is limited in any sort of way. One thing I will. Uh oh. Help me. Okay. Well, if you go into the other room. Who was it? Or what was it? In my world, women didn't glow like the moon, and they didn't walk through doors either. I had to be more badly wounded than I thought. All right, I'll take that bite. If you want me to help you, it's locked. Okay, fair enough. However, there is something in this room I thought I'd have a look at. Oh god. Um. Hello. I think there was a woman's door over here. Cause. Huh. 